Hey everyone, welcome to Howie Inez Rules. I am out the door. We have to run a couple of errands and I'll let you know more about that, but it will end with a grocery haul. So let's go. So the weather just changed. We're, it's gonna drop like 10 degrees tomorrow. So the wind's hitting up and I gotta hit the post office, get Jonas's haircut and do the grocery shopping. Should be fun. So we're on our way now just to go drop something off at the the, um, the post office. It's one of those like ancestral like DNA kits things. I've been so excited. <laughs> yeah, he's it was a spit test. It's kind of gross. But I've been so excited to do one of those that I want to see what it says that I was. I have a really good genealogy tree already. Like my aunt did a really great um, binder full of like my family tree and all the insights and it's pretty impressive. And so we're going to go do that. But now it'll just kind of like solidify some of that evidence. I don't know. Like I'm super excited. I don't know what to expect. And now we're going to go get a haircut. So here's the before. And let's go see the after. Looks like we're ready to go in. Do you think Ezra needs a haircut? I don't think so either. It's so cute. So nice. And that Ezzy has a nice hair. <laughs> okay, look at that after. Turn to the side. There you go. That should last us a couple months. <laughs> look at me. What do you think of the, the lady who cut your hair? Um. <laughs> she's one that, uh, she's not our favorite hair cutter, but uh, I made her go over things a couple of times and I was like, hey, you need to fix this part and fix that part. Are you glad I did that? Yeah. Okay, we're going to go to Vaughn's now. Woo! -hoo. Lucky for us, it's all in the same shopping center. I don't normally like to do grocery hauls at a Vaughn store because it can be pretty pricey but I got their app and they have some good sales right now. So maybe I'll just spend some here and then do another haul later. What do you think? So I got Jonas as my calculator. Where are we at right now? 68.25. $68, all right, that, that's good. So maybe I'll let you pick a candy. Ooh, we got a lot. I can't wait to show you and tell you how much we spent. Guess what? It was crazy. I'll give you a hint. Oh, don't tell him. Guess what? It's a surprise. It's in triple digits. Oh! <laughs> so I think I did very well, and I'm gonna tell you at the end what I bought, but I'm just gonna kind of show you through and explain kind of what the sales were. So if you are, if you have a local Vons or a local Albertsons, getting their app, their digital coupons were amazing this week. So let me show you what I got. So Jonas wanted to try these. We actually have, I don't even remember the last time I actually ate a Hot Pocket, but he said he wanted to try that. I think it was like two bucks. And then we got a frozen pizza, emergency pizza. And um, you guys, it was free. It was free. Yes, it was awesome. That was part of the sale. Uh, these were $2 each. So... Um, $1.99, so I got those because we I eat a lot of eggs. These were $5, just a bag of frozen chicken breast. And then here was the big sale. So not one, but four. And look at that. Buy one, get three free. So the most expensive one was this one. Oh no, this one, $25.72. But I got all that steak for 25 bucks. That is amazing. That's about four meals for us right here. If we wanted to eat them back to back, which we won't. So I'll put them in the freezer and then we'll have some um, throughout the week. Hopefully, uh, I actually have an, an idea for a recipe, so I can't wait to show you. All right, these Grandma Sycamores were, you know, they were about Walmart price, $2.99. We got the honey whole wheat, which the boys are loving, and then just a regular one. And then Ezra, Jonas just, uh, 
He convinced me that this is the one he has to have. Gross. I mean, come on, gross. Their cereals were on sale for $1.67 if you buy three. So Rice Krispie it is, you guys. And so because we do have the cereal, we do have the milk. <laughs> so let me know in the comments so far, how am I doing? Great sales, right? Now you'll see why I got that pizza for free because it's coming up, why I got it. Okay, so we got just some tortilla chips. And they didn't have like regular Gurdel, I mean regular chocolate chips, but the Gurdelli ones were about the same price. They were $3.50. That's a little more than I like to spend, so that's why I didn't get two, just the one, because I'm making, look at over here. I got some ripe bananas. I'm gonna make those really easy cookies with the oatmeal and the chocolate chips. It's gluten-free and it, they're actually pretty good. They kind of taste like a breakfast, a breakfast cookie or of something. Um, just some snacks because the kids, man, if they do a good job, I let them just pick something out. But they have to wait for after dinner. <laughs> the ice cream was $2.99 each. Peanut butter chocolate. Oh, as Jonas picked that one. And then these are for lunches, I think. <laughs> I got some red wine vinegar. I think I just threw my last one away. I have a recipe coming up and i got some just regular vinegar because um i'm kind of wanting to soak my uh, my water uh, faucets just to get some of the crud off of the rims and stuff do you know what i mean let me know in the comments if you do that next up we got the sodas these two were five dollars and then that's why i got the free pizza is that amazing? Oh man. These are normally like six bucks each. Crazy. Sometimes they have good sales. And then these are all 88 cents or 87 cents. And so you can see we like just the Sprite, Fresca, just some of those clear ones. Um, yeah, the boys will drink that. And then I'll just have like maybe one of these with dinner. Okay, next up, here's the healthy part. Yes. Look at all of that yumminess. I got some celery and some carrots because that just seems like the best combo in soups lately. So I am loving getting all of that veggies. And then I got some broccoli for an upcoming recipe. Just some more bananas. Can't forget potatoes. I love making mashed potatoes, baked potatoes. It is all good. And then these grapes were like 87 cents a pound. Normally they're like $3 a pound. So got both of them. I know I think the Phillips love putting some in the freezer. This would be a good time to do that. But we just like eating them. So I think these are like $4 for both bags. Not bad. So we ran into a friend on the way out, one of our, our fram. <laughs> and he was there with his daughters and he was like, I'm so good. I just went in for the one thing my wife told me to get. And I said, hey, my whole cart, $108. Oh my gosh, you guys, $108. This is like a legit haul. Like I pay these prices at Walmart or even Winco and I did so good. I got my chicken, I got my beef. I'm good for a minute here, maybe like a week. We'll see. I say that and I have teenagers or almost teenagers or just a bunch of boys and they're hungry all the time. But that's okay because $108, which means I have more money to spend. So I'll maybe do like a mini like grocery haul or go pick up some things that I need for future recipes or if we're just running out of stuff. We still have lunch meat in the fridge. We still have cheeses. So I'm good, you guys. I feel like I can create some meals with what we have. Let me know in the comments what you, if any of these items are your go-to items or if I should be looking for some specialty items that are at Vaughn's or Albertson's. Let me know in the comments. I'm so grateful you stopped by. Give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't clicked subscribe, I'd love for you to tag along. I do lots of shopping. I do lots of grocery hauls. Uh, I do lots of easy recipes, baking and cooking. I'm all about the good, easy stuff. So thanks so much again and stick around rollers. You just never know what I'll be rolling out next. Bye everyone.